given the difference between simple interest for 2 years and compound interest for 2 years on the same sum at the same rate of interest compounded annually is 120 so which means difference for 2 years is equal to 120 the difference between the simple interest for 3 years and compound interest for 3 years on the same sum at the same rate of interest is 366 so difference for 3 years is equal to 366 so use the formula you know that in case of 2 years the principal p is equals to d into 100 squared by r squared and in case of 3 years the principal p can be taken as difference d 366 here into 100 cube by r squared into 300 plus r that's it two equations and two unknowns what are the two unknowns p and r can you solve yes of course what you can do here is since he's asking us to find out the rate of interest equate these two since both are p and p i can say 120 into 100 squared by r squared equals to 366 into 100 cube by r square into 300 plus r simplify what happens r square gets cancelled right this 100 square and this gets cancelled so what do we have uh, we will have 120 into 300 plus r 120 into 300 plus r equals to 366 into 100 solve now this is 20 into 6 this is 20 into 5 and this 6 goes how many times here 61 times how much is 61 into 5 305 305 minus 300 is 5 so rate of interest r is equal to 5 percentage 5 percentage per annum what is complex about it